All right, I tried to do my hair. We tried. And by tried, I mean I only did like the front. I didn't feel like doing it. <laughs> what up? What's going on? I'm doing another makeup look and today I am doing... I love Marilyn Monroe. Ever since I was a kid, I have always been obsessed with Marilyn Monroe. I remember I did like book reports on her in my art class. I did like would do paintings. Anyway, I've always wanted to dress up like her. That's usually what my normal everyday makeup is, but her makeup is super easy. And it's pretty basic, but I was thinking one night, I literally was asleep and I woke up and I was like, I'll reenact it. I was like, Andy Warhol, Marilyn Monroe. And that's what happened. So, I don't know if anybody's ever done this before. They probably have, but that's okay. I don't care. I'm gonna do it. We're gonna do, um, this. Oh, Marilyn Monroe, Andy Warhol. It's like a paint by numbers looking picture. So let's go. The hair, just forget it. I could not find, like, spray color anywhere, so I just figured, like, if I didn't use my purple shampoo for a little bit, it would turn my hair yellow. I mean, it's not, like, highlighter yellow. We're gonna start off with the face. We're gonna use my Wet n Wild palettes that I got, Bright and Vive one. And for the face, I'm gonna use this light pink. This is gonna take a long time. Send in the clip. That was my hip. All right, I got a makeup sponge now. Oh my! So yeah, I used to do, um, I remember I used to write like book reports and English essays on Marilyn Monroe because I was fully upset. I don't know where it came from. I don't know how it started. You can't even tell on camera. It's very pink. I promise it's pink. If I can find it, I have, um, I did this really awful collage, um, like a paper mache collage of her in my art class. It, it's terrible, but uh, if I can find it, I'll put a <laughs> picture of it in there. I have no idea how this is going to turn out. This could either go, either be really cool looking or just a stupid. Oh my god, I've already hit pan. I look like one of the backyardigans. Send in the clown. I was going to use that song, Send in the Clowns for my Joker makeup look, and now I can't get that out of my head. Which, by the way, you should check it out if you haven't seen it already. I'm not doing the neck. Mm -mm. I don't care. So next up, we're going to do the eyes and the mouth and the her beauty mark. Alright, so I'm going to go in and use the hot pink in here, and we're going to do like a cut crease. Those around like this. I mean, I'll put a picture right up here. See, so why does my camera keep moving? Please don't do this to me. Not right now. Deal with it. Wow. Maybe I should have mapped this out. Sorry, I'm not talking. I'm like really concentrating. No, I'm gonna just do the other eye. This one's a little bit hard. Well, not really. It, she's her head is turned this way, so you can't really see it too much. But I'll just do basically the same thing. Oh, I just thought of something. I just remembered how hard this was to wash off from the Joker makeup. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. This one's not as great, but her head is turned in the picture a little bit, at, or like there's a shadow over it, so you can't really see too well. And she's got her beauty mark. I got the eyes backwards. I'm an idiot. This is the one that's supposed to be on this side. I'm looking at it like the beauty mark is like right here. It's a big pink circle for this. It's really big. I didn't mean to do it that big. Wipe it off and start again. That's good enough. Okay, and then her mouth. She's got... Oh, I'm so confused now. It's like this kind of outlines. Oh, this is like Malibu Barbie pink. This one on this side comes out a little bit further. Now we're going to get into a, a part that could really just ruin it. We're going to contour with black eyeshadow. I'm going to go ahead and just do the, the beauty mark first. I'm going to use eyeliner. It's a little off-centered too. And now I'm going to do the lips. Let's just do those first. Oh 
Alright, I'm really like overlining my lips. I'm not gonna do my teeth. Her teeth are actually pink in the picture, I'm not. So next, I should probably do my eyebrows. I'm gonna just fill in with the black eyeshadow actually. This is probably not smart. I, pr I think I look like a mime. I'm really doing the clown theme this year, aren't I? This eye- oh, Honey. In my head, this looked really cool. <laughs> I, would, I just want to be pop art, Marilyn. Okay, we're going to contour now. I'm going to use black because it's black in the picture. I didn't set the face paint either, so it's still tacky. I'm doing the wrong side again. Hers like comes into her eyebrow and her eye. It looks stippled on. Okay, this brush is really kind of rough, so I'm using this for the stippling part. I just want to be Marilyn Monroe. It's not going how I thought it would. Why can't I be like you, Marilyn? I hope this was entertaining to y'all because it was a complete mess to me. Look, it looks like I have a beard. Oh! I'm an idiot. I didn't even do my lashes. Maybe that'll tie it together. I'm gonna go in with the hot pink and put this on the lips so it can be a highlight. Sort of. So I'm now going to go in and do my lashes and my eyeliner and the mo like one of the most iconic things about Marilyn and I didn't even think about doing it. I'm using my Ardell 120 lashes. I'm just going to put the glue on and let them start drying while I do my liner. Greta Gabo and Monroe. Dietrich and DiMaggio. Come on, Rogue. Let your body go with the flow. Okay, normally I would, like, be more particular about getting it, like, super straight and stuff, but since it's pop art, it kind of, I mean, look, is out of the lines. You know what I mean? Do I look like her now? <sighs> I just want to be Marilyn Monroe. But you want to go with the flow, you know, come on, Vogue. Beauty's where you find it. Look around. Well, we got the lashes on. She's got um, some shading going into like her eye. I keep doing the wrong one. <sighs> this is a nightmare. My lips are so dry. Well, how much more messed up could it get? Famous last words. It goes like onto her eye. Okay, but T? It's called the dance floor. And here's what it's for. Come on, Vogue. We should take a shot every time I sing a part of Vogue. Well, we gave it our best effort. We really, uh, well, you didn't do anything. I did it. I don't know what I was expecting. I just want to, I just want to be Marilyn Monroe. I think face part, this part, should have been a little bit more of a peachy color. It looks a little too white. I mean, that's not my only problem here. Well, thanks for watching. I really was so excited for this one. So if you like the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. My nose itches. Yeah, just subscribe, please. Alright. I'm sweating. I forgot to do it again. I've already taken off my lashes. I forgot to say it. I'm gonna do that thing. I'm gonna put some part of the video over. You know it. Okay, ready? Here we go. Wow, I snapped. Yeah. Alright, now I'm going. Bye.